her. Who doesn't know Chloe at this point? Hi. She stars in the hit show True Blood. She's back with the scoop on everything pop culture. Good morning, Chloe. Hey. Good morning. Okay. Uh, we hear that you went to the Whaley house. We have some pictures. Oh. Tell us all about it. What would you think? I love the Whaley house. I've always been into the Sherp Supernatural. Um, it's one of two official haunted houses Ooh. in California. Wow. It's like the big ones. Yeah. There you are in the, ooh, where is that? You're like in the dining room that, here? Oh my gosh, did you just read my mind? I did. Whoa. Wow. Um, I, I think I had some paranormal experiences. <laughs> and um, while I was in the children's room, there was just a picture of that. Um, oh yeah, right there, um, that was the children's room. Um, we took a picture of it, and we have a camera that detects if somebody blinks. Wow. So it said, did someone blink? And we thought, mm, well, the camera's just acting up because nobody could go inside. There, There's glass. So did, nobody could go inside. Did you feel like there was maybe something going on, maybe a ghost, maybe something like that supernaturally? Maybe. Um, later, though, Cecilia was Ooh. telling us she was one of the guys. Right. Cecilia, Cecilia was telling us about, um, did you check out the children's room? Because the doll in the purple dress blinks. Whoa. And we like freaked out right. like, what the heck? The doll <laughs> blinks. Ooh. Yeah. Yeah. So, Whaley yeah. House is pretty cool. And, and ironically, you also saw Paranorman over yeah. the weekend. You know, we had Tucker. He's the voice of the little boy in Paranorman. Tucker. Uh, was on our show last week, and he was pretty cool. Did you like the movie? Was it pretty nice? It was really good, but mm -hmm. I would recommend it for kids that were over eight. Okay. Because the movie was really scary. And you are? And I'm nine. nine you qualify. 10. You qualify over eight. So was it a cool movie? It had a lot of ghosts and stuff like that? It didn't have that many ghosts, but... You know, uh, what am I saying? The whole point of it was about ghosts. <laughs> and... Uh, it's about this boy, little boy yeah. named Norman, who sees ghosts. Wow. Like, like, not like we see ghosts, like maybe a shadowy figure. Right. It's like he sees the people. It's, like the actual people. Yeah, wow. it's crazy. Um, and he has to save his town from a witch's curse. Whoa. Ooh, I like yeah. that light. Did you see that? And then he has all his friends, and they're all driving around, and look at that. That's pretty yeah. neat. Uh, by the way, I wanted to, you know, a lot of people going back to school. Chloe, are you going? Are yep. you? Am I hearing this right? Yep. Chloe tomorrow. is going back to school tomorrow. Tomorrow's a big day. Are you very excited? Yeah. That's what I'm doing today. Today's going to be like my fun day. I'm going to Legoland. Woo. Woo and I have some great back to school tips. Okay, give me some. Back to school tips. Here we go. Awesome binder. Of course. You need a binder. Is it a three-ring binder? It is a three-ring binder. Outstanding. You know, I had one of those and, when I was a kid. Um, what I did, you could, you don't have to do wrapping paper. Okay. Um, you can just do, like, pictures of places you've been, your friends, like, um, like your pictures of your dogs. So what I did is I took wrapping paper and I covered it in laminate. Oh, wow. I think that's what it's, is that what it's called? Sure, I think yeah. laminate is correct, yeah. yep, yep. And I cut out some, um, some cupcakes that cupcakes. made out felt, and I glue, hot glued it to the binder and then put some little rhinestones on there to make it look like sprinkles. Oh, wow. You bedazzled your three-ring binder. Ooh. I love it. See, you kind of make it your own. It's personalized. And I use, this is the same binder I used last, right. last year. It's, but so, it's, like, it's like a whole new binder now, and guess yeah, what? The is. best part is nobody will have a binder that looks exactly like yours, because yours is an original. And right? also, turn this old... Com oh, wait. Uh, okay, here we go. <laughs> this old composition book yeah. into a matching one for your binder. Yes. <laughs> and I even did mini cupcakes. I love... You like cupcakes? I do like cupcakes. Oh, I love... What's your favorite cupcake? Red velvet. Red velvet. Well, who isn't? Who doesn't like red velvet? Doesn't like red velvet, people. Yeah. For crying it's out like loud. Ham. It's red velvet. It's like ham. Who doesn't like ham? Who doesn't like ham? Well, that's a Vegetarians. whole other. Vegetarians. That's a whole other I discussion. I feel bad for them. There are some people who don't like ham. Yeah. But 
By the way, uh, you walked in with that really awesome backpack that looks like oh, you got it out of like yeah. Super Mario Brothers or something. Where yeah. did you get that thing? That is the coolest backpack ever. When I, the day I got it, it was <laughs> a gift from, <laughs> it was um, the brand's Mad Packs, and it's a gift, and I wanted to say that it was my pink Bowser backpack. I love it. It is and a Bowser backpack. And my mom said, backpack. no, no, we shouldn't do that. And then later, my mom's friend said, oh, it looks like a pink Bowser backpack. I'm like, it's a I did it. I am right. It's a pink Bowser backpack. And that backpack. felt so good. Also, oh, not yes. only do I have this giant one, I have Mini Dude. Mini what? Dude. What is that? This is a Mini Mad Pack. Oh, my goodness. It's wow. like a little purse. It is like a little purse. And I need one of those. you can carry some great stuff in it. Like, you can put your wallet or your DS. Very, very nice for me. I even bedazzled my you DS. You bedazzled your, yeah, your DS. That's pretty cool. Hey, so have so fun good. at Legoland. You know, last week we sang a little journey together. I will yeah. abstain from singing today. No singing from me. But if you would like to take us out on this back-to-school edition with a little song. Okay. Take it away, Miss Chloe. It's all yours. Yeah, but now I'm a little sad that my oh. favorite singing partner won't be well, with I me. Well, I may or may not chime in, depending on whether or not I know the words. Okay. What, what song are you going to do? I'm going to give you a little Pat Benatar. Pat Benatar? Yes. Rocking the 80s, Hit Chloe. me with the best shot. Come on, hit me with the best shot. Hit me with the best shot. Fire away. Yeah. Come on with it, come on, you don't, don't fight, fight fair. fair. That's, That's okay. okay. See if I can. Knock me down, it's all in vain. I'll give her okay. back on my feet again. Hit me with your best shot. Fair near, fair near. Hit me with your best shot. Fair near, fair near. Hit me with your best shot. Fair near, fair near. Fire away. Fair, fair. Fair near. Wow. Ladies and gentlemen, Miss Chloe will be back next week with The Dish on Pop Culture. Yeah, she's our little superstar here, you know? Chloe, I think you're our favorite guest ever. Oh, thank you. All right, thank you, sweetheart. I love your backpack. See you later, San Diego. Bye. Look at her. She's a pro. She's Peace, San Diego. I'm out. I'm going to Legoland, son. I love that backpack, by the way. All right, uh, still ahead. It's 929. Parents are out.